Hey, what up decisive marketers? So today I'm going to bring you another video on uh, one of my automation series right here. And this automation, right, what it does is um, it's going to automatically reply to new Google My Business reviews, right? And uh, I think a lot of people are asking about this, like how to set this up. So I thought that I would create this video to show all of you how to do it. And it's very simple because it's a uh, single step automation right single step um i would say it's more like two steps but uh yeah it's kind of similar right um because you'll only see uh, a single step in the automation itself so we're going to be using Pebbly connect to do this uh, but before i dive in be sure to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content so here we are in uh in uh, my Pebbly connect uh, workflow right here which is uh, to be honest, this is very, very simple. We can probably finish this video in less than five minutes. So the first step is make sure you choose the app, which is uh, Google My Business. And once you have it connected, okay, so connect with your Google account, okay. And uh, once you have connected, uh, select your review location, right? So uh, select your review location, okay. And you would then, re uh, you know, uh, you know when uh, you would then receive a response okay and this would be how the ref uh, response uh, look like so you have the uh, review id which is uh, you know a string of uh, characters and uh, stuff like that and then you got your reviewer profile uh, photo right and then you got the reviewer's name and the star rating as well as the comment when it's created when it's updated maybe they've edited the uh, comment okay and then uh I'm not really, sh really sure what this is right here. Okay, I guess this is like the link to the review itself, uh, most likely. Okay, so uh, anyway, we don't really have to use everything right here. So the first one is, uh, the next step is to use a router because uh, you are, you possibly, you are not going to be replying to people who, uh, leave a five star review and the one star review the same way right so what you're gonna be doing is uh, you you'll be setting a router up so the router for the five star rating so you set the uh, you know the label uh, five star rating to be equals to five and it's got to be spelled this way because this is how the response come in right the value of the response come in uh, it's uh, five which is spelled with f i v e okay so you set it to equals to this, right? Because uh, for Pebbly router, there is no uh, option to, you know, have a value between this and this. So uh, besides this value is not in a number form. So, uh, you know, there's no way to, uh, you know, set up an easier way of routing. So you want to set it to equals to then the action would be to create a reply right so there is uh, different actions right here uh, but of course the one that you want to choose uh, for review replies would be create reply okay and then uh, this is the reply itself okay so the name would be the person right so you want to select name okay so uh, over here you want to be selecting this one name so this is uh, because this is the reply uh, this is actually the review itself so you're telling Pebbly that this is the reply uh, sorry this is the review that I want to reply to okay and then uh, you can put in your reply right here okay and another one uh, another thing that you can do is uh, you know if you want to personalize it a little bit you can just put in the display name okay and save it so what happens is that when there is a reply uh when when you leave a reply it will be thank you for your review uh comma and then the person's name okay so that would be for the five star and of course you know uh you want you want to do that for the other uh number of stars right so um if it's one star it will be spelled this way so it's always uh one two three four five uh with capitalized uh you know the format right so everything is capitalized okay 
and uh, and then you can have a reply right here. So um, if it's a if it's a bad review, then you know this is what I sent out. Uh, we apologize for the experience you had. Okay, so maybe we can personalize it a little bit and put in the name. Okay, we apologize for the experience you had. Would you be able to email us and then we will uh, understand you better? Okay. So you know that's how you would you know uh, automate your uh, reviews on Google My Business, right? So very very simple uh, automation right here. It's just a single, um, it's more like a double step uh, automation because you got a router in between, but you know you will see it this way. So that's all I have uh, in this video. Let me know what you think about this automation. Would you want to use it uh, or do you feel that you should reply as a human? Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below uh, whether you'll be using this uh, automation. If you enjoyed this video, do give me a thumbs up and, let, and if you know anyone who wants to be automating their Google My Business reviews, be sure to uh, you know share this video with them and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.